prescribed burns to help stop wildfires. It's part of a plan to help keep our area safe. And leaders from the Forest Service, Trails and Open Space Program, the Pikes Peak Outdoor Recreation Alliance all coming together tonight. The Norris Penrose Event Center in the Springs, our Maggie Bryan was at that State of the Outdoors event. Maggie, tell us what you learned there tonight. Yeah, Robin Diane, the group said part of the solution to tackle wildland fires here in the Pikes Peak region is more prescribed burns. The Forest Service says four times as many burns are needed to keep up with the changing urban interface. In the past five years, the Forest Service says fires have affected five million people along Colorado's Front Range. The Pikes Peak District Ranger says with continued growth, there needs to be an updated plan of action for our national forests to reduce fire danger. This is something that we have never done in my career. A two to five year plan outlining more prescribed burns and thinning dead trees and undergrowth of forests in the region. Wildfire crisis strategy is basically our marching orders from our chief to increase the pace and scale of the fuels treatments that we do. He says the Colorado Front Range is one of 21 national priority landscapes because of its high fire risk. He says the plan for four times as many prescribed burns will promote new vegetation growth. Those lands come back really flush. But can have impacts on communities. People are concerned rightfully so when there's smoke in the air. They don't know where it's coming from, if it's a natural fire or if it's a prescribed fire. The Pikes Peak Outdoor Recreation Alliance says the public will be alerted before the plans take place. If you all are informed, you know where that's going to happen, when it's going to happen. You can change your recreational plans. At the end of the day, the district ranger says doing the work now will help local fire departments to protect residential areas. Our responsibility is to manipulate the vegetation on Forest Service lands such that it gives our firefighters the best opportunity to keep fires small and stop fires before they reach the private property. The district ranger says the first prescribed burn for national forest lands will be in the fall. That burn will take place in Ensign Gulch, just northwest of the Air Force Academy. He says they are starting small and burning just about 450 acres.